Well, hello. So today we're going to talk about how we, the liberals, helped Donald Trump become our president. What? Mind blown. I'm going to let you know the magical secrets. So anybody that is aware of the secret, the secret is basically whatever you give attention to is whatever you will fruit in your reality. Whether you like it or whether you don't, whatever you're passionate about, you will attract that into your life. So millions of Americans, billions of people throughout the world were angered by Donald Trump. They were angered. And Donald Trump knew this. Donald Trump has been playing this card for a very long time. He angers people in order to garnish their attention, in order to feed off their attention. And then he gets into power. He's done this through The Apprentice. He's done this through his career. He's done this through his entire lifetime. So this is how he managed to manipulate the frequency of humanity. Now, a humanity doesn't realize that whatever we can... I don't know if you've noticed it, but have you noticed that like when you get really, really angry at something, it also comes back over and over and over again? It feels like you're hitting that wall over and over again, over again. Well, I see various... One of my friends... And I think that as a liberal, I think it's painful because... I mean, this, I, this is, this is a nightmare scenario, right? <laughs> For a lot of us. So a lot of people, and when I've said some of these things where we as liberals chose Donald Trump to become our president, I think a lot of people were like, what? Ah, I'm so angry that you said that. I'm like, but it's the truth. It's the truth. We fed him with our energy. We fed him with our understanding. We fed him with our consciousness. So as the year moves forward, I think that we need to really take account as to what it is that we're feeding. So for instance, a lot of really uh, the EPA, if you care about the environment, then you talk about the positive things about the environment, the great efforts that are being made in the environment. That way you create a uh, appreciation for that. The gay and lesbian community, what you do is you talk about the great and uh, things that are happening within the gay and lesbian community. A lot of people may be like, I don't know, are we going to lose gay marriage? I was like, well, don't fear. Just empower the positive until you see what ha what's happening. Of course, we don't have complete control over, over all of reality. That's all of us as humanity. Um, so we have to come together and we have to kind of reshape and we have to pause. We have to restrict and we need to think of ourselves. What am I feeding? What am I feeding? Really, what do I want? What do I really want? And how am I, as a, as a wizard, as a magician, in this reality, with the powers that I have, I'm speaking to you. What are you creating for, with your thoughts and with your mind? With the things that you post on Facebook? Because clearly, there's a lot of people that are very, very angry at Donald Trump. Still, that's fine. That's fine. You can go ahead and be angry. But at a certain point in time, you have to understand that that anger is what's giving him power. I want to wish you all a wonderful year. Take care. Let me know what you think about it. And uh, maybe we can come up with a new way in order to take down the enemy. I wish you all a wonderful year. Take care.